two home series left for Ohio State men's hockey. In the race for consecutive regular season conference championships, a win in this weekend series will put the Buckeyes in the driver's seat. What's shaking Buckeye Nation? I'm Blake Baker with OhioStateBuckeyes.com, previewing a pair of games versus the preseason Big Ten favorite, Penn State. They're a fast uh, puck moving team. Um, I think uh, we can stick to our structure and play uh, good defensively and possess pucks. I think we'll be okay against them. And they're a great team. They're, you could tell by the record and everything. And I mean, as a goalie, you know, they're going to shoot everything from anywhere and they're going to try to play as much offense as they can. Penn State, uh, they haven't changed. Uh, they love to get up and down the rink. They got lots of talent. They try to put lots of pressure on you, your goaltender. They're all about offense. And it's paying off. Penn State currently leads the league in 15 statistical categories. Among them, goals, scoring margin, and shots on goal. When it comes to special teams, Penn State leads the league in penalty kill percentage, but the Buckeyes have scored the most power play goals in the conference. So the numbers may paint Penn State in a slightly better light, but these two have almost identical records. And they've also been through recent rough patches. For the Buckeyes, their last two weekends have not been entirely pretty, but they ended it with a win, which nowadays is really all that matters. Everybody's searching for points now. You look at our league, I mean, it's anybody's ball game, and I think all of us coaches would have said the same thing at the beginning of the year, but here it is. I mean, six games to go, you, you know, you're searching for points every night. To repeat as regular season champs, Tommy Napier is going to have to be a big factor between the pipes. Luckily, he says he's back to 100%. In that win over that team up north, he looked it, saving 35 shots and earning his 13th win this season. In the Big Ten, that ranked second only behind Penn State's Peyton Jones. Carrying the mojo of beating your rival on the road, good. Having your goaltender, who's one of the best in the game right now, back to full health, very good. But the best asset for this Buckeye team approaching this weekend is the Buckeye Nation factor. We're excited to be back here. The crowds have been great. We're, we're excited to get back in front of them. And, you know, we're looking forward to a great matchup with Penn State. Great matchup coming here to the shot. Great stuff aside from the play on the ice happening as well. Starts on Friday with Dollar Dog Night brought to you by Sugardale. And that's delightful, but the Brutus Snow Globes that we have are even cooler. You can get one of those with your ticket on the night, but there's only 500 available. So make sure you get here early ahead of the 7 p.m. puck drop on Friday. And then on Saturday, it's your last chance to see Script Ohio on ice this season. Puck drop is at 5 p.m. that night, and the best darn band in the land will take the ice at the second intermission. And don't forget about our military jersey auction happening until Monday at 5 p.m. So those bad boys can still be yours, but you gotta place your bid before that time. That link is easily accessible through OhioStateBuckeyes.com, which, as you know, has all your news on all things Buckeyes all the time. So do our social media channels, so give those a follow at OhioSTAthletics. Need a nutty crowd when the Nittany Lions come to town? Be here, be loud, and beat Penn State. Go Bucks!